Hey, I'm Denny from Manitou. I'm here at Sea Otter with MTBR, and uh, I've got a model year 10 Manitou R7 here. And what's new for 2010 is we have a, a new damper called Absolute Plus. It's got independent high and low speed damping. The low speed damper is called Speed Needle, and it's a needle based damper. I've actually got one right here. So the low speed damper is externally adjustable. <clears throat> In the closed position, it's, uh, the fork is effectively locked out except for the high speed damper and in the open position it's open. The, uh, the needle itself looks like this. Tapered needle that moves up and down into an orifice and as you thread the needle in it uh, makes that orifice smaller. The high speed damper is it's like a, a lot like a TPC damper. It's shim based. These are the, this is the shim stack here and these are the ports through which the oil passes. So unless the, the speed needle is totally closed, you've always got oil moving through the low speed damper, but the, uh, the high speed damper is engaged on any sort of a, a high force, high speed impact. So this will appear on all of our forks in 2010, except for the Dorado, which has the TPC Plus damper. Uh, it's also compatible with our new lockout lever, called the Milo, and that's this year. It's got a really narrow footprint. It's only six millimeters wide, so it works with every combination of brake and shifter and can be mounted between the, the brake and the shifter. can be mounted inboard, can be mounted outboard, depending on how you like your bar set up. It works by just pressing down with your thumb and it unlocks by pressing in like that. So real simple and uh, compatible with the Absolute Plus damper. And uh, the other thing to note is the, the Absolute Plus damper is retrofittable into all Manitou forks going back to 2007. So if you've got an R7 or a Minute and you want to upgrade to the new damper, all you do is pull out your old TPC or Absolute damper and drop this one in.